guys, it is TemC here today, and I'm bringing you guys another video related to tech. I apologize for not uploading any vlogs recently, I've been pretty busy with some testing and exams and things like that, so I haven't had actual time to edit vlogs and produce content since most of the time all I was doing was reviewing my notes and stuff. So recently, WWDC at the Worldwide Developer Conference, Apple announced <coughs> iOS 10 and the new Mac OS and some other, like, you know, TV OS and watch OS. But a lot of people want to get access to iOS 10 because apparently claimed by Apple it is their biggest update yet. And I'm not going to lie, it does have a lot of promising features. However, since it is a developer beta, there will be some slight lag or little glitches here and there that Apple needs to sort out before the official release of iOS 10 in September for the actual consumers. However, a lot of people want to get the enjoyment of using iOS 10 months before it even comes out to consumers. So today I'm going to be showing you a method on how to get iOS 10 on almost any device, which I will link the devices below which that can um, support iOS 10. And you can just get on your device and enjoy it. You do not need a computer for this. It's all happening right on your iDevice. So the first thing you want to do is go and link below and then copy the link that I'm going to paste. So I will leave the link in the description below. If you just tap on it, it should bring you to the screen and then you will get the pop up and it will just go right into settings. So something like this, as soon as you click the link in the description below, it will pop up like this and it'll just load in like that. So don't worry about copying it. If you can't copy it, just click it. This little window will pop up right here as you can see. It says iOS beta software profile. And what you will need to do is just in the top right corner, you will click install. Then this is the message from here. Just click install once more. Install profile, install. And then it says you will need to restart your iDevice for the changes to be applied. So just restart it. All right, so once it has restarted, you just want to unlock your iDevice. And I'm gonna go into settings and show you guys that I am on iOS 9.2.1. So you guys can see there, that's pretty much it. That's all you need to, guys, you need to know. So from there, what you want to do is very, everything from here is very simple. You just go as if you're about to install a brand new software update, click on it. It will show up here, click download and install. Agree to the terms and conditions. Once you agree, the update will request and it will start downloading and then obviously like a normal update once it finishes downloading it will ask you to restart. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Like I said, it is a first beta so it might have some issues here and there but Apple will update it very shortly with more fixes and more issues to be resolved and things like that so the experience will be much smoother. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be back in a little bit once it actually installs just to show you guys a little preview so if you guys decide to update or not. Alright guys, so once it finishes installing, you'll come up to this screen where you just have to go through a little setup process. So I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. If you guys could subscribe and leave a like, that would really be very, very helpful. Alright guys, vlog is coming out soon, so I'm looking forward to uploading that on about Friday. And that's all. Have a great one. Bye.